Hello everyone, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Alparji And in this video, I will discuss about factor in language learning yes. Language is a such complex phenomenon that has become a common study point of many social scientists Such as uh, linguistic, psycholinguistic, sociolinguistic, neurolinguistic, and historical linguistic In this case, for exam, this felt the term is possible find many definition and theory which that try to expand language. It's a nature and development through the history and the effect of psychology and society on the language. Linguistic is such a specific study of human language and the main concern of this field is to define the language and its nature from meaning and context. The first is social aspect of using a second language cannot be ignored since a second language learning involves the acquisition of a, a second identity. In this process, social distance, uh, social distance may occur a social distance. Uh, social distance is cognitive and affective proximity proximity of two cultures that can connect with individual. This term is used metaphorically to denote the similarity between two cultures. Some learners may feel this term against the third uh, culture and the process of a second language learning. Uh, and the second is motivation. Which is one of the psycholinguistic dimension. It is the key concept of language learning process. Motivation is defined to Oxford English Dictionary as a reason or reason for acting or behaving a particular way and is uh, and is right for willings to do something. In the autism, it can be considered a driving force. In other words. A psychological, a psychological drive a compass or response in action toward the circuit goals. It is sense motivation related uh, for again language uh, language learning will be defined as purpose for doing this. For a, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> for purpose for doing these uh, things that will be lead to learning uh, for language. Maintaining a high level of motivation during a period of language learning is one of the best ways to make all process successful. The third is personality and the learning styles. Personality and the learning are the, the learning style are among the psycholinguistic factor with the effect of Fergan language learning process directly or indirectly. Personality is the particular combination of emo emotional, attitudinal, uh, sorry, uh, attitudinal and behavioral response patterns and individual. On other hand, learning style is learn is term generally used to describe an individual natural or habitual pattern of according and processing information in a learned situation. <laughs> Some aspects of uh, personality and learning style are extraput, instro, uh, extroversion and introversion, uh, risking thinking, feel independent, dependence, and a visual, auditory, and uh, kinesity. Uh, uh, sorry. Learning strategies is the is the last dimension discussed under the having of psycholinguistic factor with the effects of the foreign language learning process. The learning start the learning strategy are used by students to help them understand information and solve problem. A learning strategy is a person person's approach to learning using information. Learning strategies consult the four men composing as cognitive strategy, metacognitive strategy, social strategy, and affirmative strategy. And that's all from me from my main map about a factor in language learning. 
thank you for watching and see you Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh